Hello and welcome to airgunweb.com, your home for honest, real-world airgun reviews and information where we bring you the facts, not fluff. I've been wanting to review this next product for years. It's the RWS LP8 Brake Barrel Spring Pistol in 177. When it showed up at my door a little while back, I was really excited to finally have the opportunity to really put it through the paces. Let's go ahead and get started. The RWS LP8 is a very hefty little air pistol. Its all metal, German made, high quality construction is evident the moment you pick it up. The LP8 is a large frame pistol that's going to be better suited for larger hands. Because it's fairly heavy, shooters are going to need to have good arm and upper body strength to hold it steady and to see consistent accuracy. As you plan to shoot from a bench, then the added weight becomes a distinct advantage as it helps really mitigate the recoil. The pistol ships with front and rear fiber optic sights with the rear sight being fully adjustable. These work great to provide a very fast target acquisition and accuracy provided you have the eyesight to take advantage of them. Fortunately for me, the LP8 also has an integrated 11mm dovetail, so I can use my BSA pistol scope. While the recoil from other brake barrel pistols I've tested has really caused some issues with scope creep, I've had no issues with this LP8. I believe the textured finish has a lot to do with helping the scope mount remain secure on the rail. Let's go ahead and walk through operation. The LP8 ships with a little cocking aid. So it simply slides on the front of the barrel, allows you to cock the pistol much more easily. Now you'll want to secure the barrel when you load your pellet. You'll also notice that cocking the gun engages the automatic safety. Load my pellet, close the barrel, Aim the pistol at my attendant target, release the safety, and gently squeeze the trigger. Let's do that one more time. Go ahead and cock the, cock the pistol. Always secure the barrel. Load your pellet. Close the barrel. Release the safety. And gently squeeze the trigger. The RWS LP8 is rated as getting up to 580 feet per second with lightweight lead pellets. My test pistol topped out around 520 with the 7 grain RWS hobby pellets. While the RWS hobby pellets are a good all around pellet, I found that the H&N Finale Match pistol pellets at 7.56 grain provided a little better accuracy and consistency. They averaged 501 feet per second and generated 4.21 foot pounds. Achieving consistent accuracy with the LP8 is going to take a little work. Hold, trigger control, and follow through are all critically important. To evaluate the LP8's accuracy, I shot all my groups at 10 yards from a rest. All of my groups were under one inch, center to center. Here are my two best groups, which measured a lot better than that. So let's go ahead and take a look at our final summary. Finally getting to shoot the LP8 has certainly been worth the wait. If I were going to be picky, I'd have to mention that the trigger could have been smoother and shorter in the second stage. But that's really all I can find to mention. The rest of the pistol completely impressed me. It's extremely well built. It cocks and cycles as nicely as any German built air gun I've ever fired. And it's consistently accurate and predictable. The price point on the LP8 is higher than other similarly marketed products, but as with most things, you really do get what you pay for. The refinement and attention to detail really shines through. Having personally shot most of the competing products on the market, I would definitely choose the LP8 
to sit at the top of my list for brake barrel pellet pistols. I'd like to take a moment to thank the folks over at Umarex USA for providing the review product and supplies for this review. And of course, Pyramid Air for sponsoring Airgun Web in this video. When you're looking for your next air gun or you're looking to fill your next air gun supply order, go ahead and visit www.pyramidair.com or give them a call at 888-262-4867. And please be sure to let them know that you learned about them right here at Airgun Web. When you're looking for honest, real-world air gun reviews, think Airgun Web, where we tell you the facts, not fluff. I'm Rick Utzer with airgunweb.com. Thanks again for watching.